Right guys, so as you can see by the title, this is five things that you definitely need to vlog. Number one on the list, this is very, very simple, but you need one. It is a camera. This is a very small camera, I know, I was just using it for demonstration purposes. But you will need a camera. This is actually a pretty decent camera, it's got screen and... On OK button, on, on button, but it is a very good camera. Nonetheless, it shoots in 1080p. But you definitely need a camera. They start from 50 pound and up, in pretty much any camera, if you want to get it decent. The next thing is obviously a selfie stick. This helps so much when you're holding it and obviously recording yourself and stuff like that. Next thing on my list is a sharpie. This may seem stupid. But if you do get out there and get famous from YouTube, you will need to sign some autographs. So, just a little joke, guys, have put a uh, Sharpie in. But yeah, it's worth having one if you get famous. This thing is quite big, but it is definitely worth having. It is a swagway. A lot of YouTubers have them. Um, most, most YouTubers having, in fact, to be honest, these are so popular right now. Um... But yeah, if you can get one, if you have one, that's great. Uh, sometimes it helps with a st steady hand, actually. Uh, unless you're going to run it into Usain Bolt, which actually happened once, which was quite funny. And it happened on a cricket match as well. Just be safe on these. Um, but yeah, definitely get one. This thing is actually really simple. It's just something to edit on. You can even do it on your phone, but I just wanted to get it in the, in the v video because it's just definitely worth having a laptop in the video. Now, final thing. As you can see, there is nothing there. But wait. I would really, really suggest using your imagination, getting good topics into your videos, um, good activities to do. You could even do some challenges, like, uh, I don't know, top of my head. Oh, I've forgotten all of them, to be honest. It's just like all the challenges, like... The fire question challenge, where if you get a question wrong, you have to have a water balloon thrown at you, or something like that. I see a lot of the sidemen do it, but it's all good and fun challenges, like forfeit FIFA or something, I don't know. But good videos, um, and hope you've enjoyed watching, and I'll see you next time. See ya.